Hello, my name is Sofia Zapata and today I am back with another video for my medical assistant assignment externship homework. Today we're going to be talking about EKG, how to place an EKG on your patient. I'm sorry, just a second. So, electric electrocardium or also called the EKG. That is what I'm going to be working on today. So first, I want to tell you the steps on how you will be performing an electrocardium EKG on a patient. And then I'm going to show you a picture. Can you see it? I wish I had a, a dummy on me. It would be so much easier for me to show you because I actually think an EKG is very easy to do on a patient. So let's get started. <clears throat> First, for an EKG, you're going to want to get your equipment and supplies. You're going to need the patient health record, the EKG machine with a local with a lead cable, and label lead wires. You're going to need 10 disposable self-adhesive electrodes, alcohol wipes, the patient got in drape, a disposable razor, and a sharps container. After you've gathered all that up, you are going to want to perform the EKG in a quiet examination room away from electrical equipment to avoid artifacts. Artifacts such as anything around it can mess with the, with the EKG reading. So you want to make sure that it, that's far away from that. That way you get a correct reading. You're gonna to want to sanitize your hands and then go inside the go inside the examination room. You're gonna greet yourself and well, greet yourself, introduce yourself politely, and you're going to verify the patient by asking their name and their date of birth. After that, you are going to go ahead and ask the patient to disrobe to the waist, remove any belts, jewelry, socks, stockings, or pantyhose as necessary. Put the have the patient put the exam gown so that it does so it opens from the front. Provide the patient with privacy while he or she prepares. Then you're gonna position the patient in supine on the examination table and drape and rope and drape appropriately. I'm sorry. Okay, let's move on to the next to the next step. You're gonna turn on the machine and enter the patient's information like the MRN, the, any medication, the name, sex, and age. Yes, I said it right. Yes, I got it right. Okay, and then you are going to place the electrodes. But before you do all that, you want to make sure you go ahead and use the alcohol wipes to clean the skin. That way the electrodes can stay in place. If the areas are hairy or collect electrodes cannot be completely attached to the skin, it may be necessary to shave the areas of electrode attachment. That is when you would need a disposable razor just in case the patient is too hairy. You're going to need that. After that, you want to, after everything has been dried, the skin has been dried, you want to go ahead and place the electrodes, the electrode adhesions to the skin. Okay, so now this is what it's mostly it's going to look like. I have my book here. These are the self-adhesive electrodes and these are the lead cables. And that is part of the EKG machine. There's also an um, EKG machine. These are what electrodes look like. Now let me show you what they're going to be placed. So I have made a picture, a very pretty picture here. I attempted three times to draw that on. I wish, I really wish I had a person to do this with. This is my most accurate one, but I just wanted to let you know what the where the electrodes are gonna be doing, where they're gonna be going. So first, there's left. So this is my left, the left arm and the left leg, le a right arm and the right leg. So the electrode. One of the electrodes can be either put here or here. Here on the other side or here. And the legs and the feet, just where I have put the black circle, that's where they go. 
So it on the indicator, on the electrode in the labeling, it will say LL for left leg and LR for, uh, no, and RL for right leg. It will label for right arm, RA, and then LA for left arm. And those are going to be the first four electrodes where you are going to be putting on which are these these right here that is where you're going to be putting next on you're going to be putting on those i have created a picture here as well right here so lv they go as lv1 v2 v3 v4 v5 and v6 there is six of them LV1 is going to go here, right? This this is your rib cage, and it's going to go here. Right between, if you're a female, it, it will go right in between your chest, LV1. And then you'll go ahead and place it on the other side of the rib cage, which will be V2, and so on. It will be V2, V3, V4, and you kind of slant the electrodes down downwards as shown in the picture that i just um put on here then it will go to three two three four five six the last the last electrode will almost go on to the side that's why it's so far but it will go to the side all the way to the side it's actually pretty easy to do but pretty difficult to explain but yes, this is my video for today on a, showing a performance on EKG machine with the patient. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.